Hello everyone, welcome to the introduction of how to build a single web page application in ServiceNow. So I'm going to create a series of videos in order to show you how to create this exact application and it's going to be step-by-step -step instructions. So what are the prerequisites in how to build this application? Um, you need to be familiar with the platform itself, so you need to know the fundamentals, the key features that we have, for example, uh, what is a flow designer, what is a UI script, and UI page, this kind of information. You need to be familiar, you don't need to be an expert, but you need to know what this thing can do for uh, in ServiceNow. And also uh, have a good, under good understanding of programming language such as JavaScript or AngularJS. Um, I would like to emphasize that you don't need to be an expert. You need to just have the basic understanding, just to know what, what different things can do in the platform so let me demonstrate you what this application can do it's very simple it's it's very similar that you have in a similar application that you have in your mobile phone i mean not the look but when you enter for example you look for a uh, weather information for a city you want to type here mumbai and i'm going to click on search and you can see here i want to get the result from mumbai so i have the uh, the temperature in Fahrenheit, what kind of day that I have there, and uh, the country and also the time zone. So I can research for any city. So I can, for example, look for Boston and then see what's going on there. So I have uh, 34 degrees Celsius, no, sorry, degree Fahrenheit, and the sky is clear. So this is a very simple, basic one, but behind this simple uh, application, we have pretty much a good amount of work and uh, it's a good mini project I would say for someone who's beginning to create something in a, an application in ServiceNow. So we're gonna cover pretty much uh, how to create an action in Flow Designer, how to create a script include, writing a UI script, creating a UI page, using AngularJS in order to bind data in between UI script and UI page and in the end we are going to use materialized CSS instead of bootstrap uh, material CSS, I prefer to use that one in order to design our page. That's going to be the kind of the series of videos. Hopefully, we're gonna end up with this result. And again, you don't need to be an expert, all you need to do is to have the fundamentals of JavaScript, AngularJS, materialized CSS, and a good, good to know the platform service now itself, a different aspect of service now. The videos will be made each time on each topic. I will be spending some time to explain you what is going on there, right? So you can be a beginner and follow this uh, entire series of tutorials, videos, and in the end, uh, probably you can replicate everything that I'm doing and end up with this result and you can start to create your own application and just to have the understanding how we can create application, what are the different things that we are using. So let's get started. See you in the next video. Bye.